And we are back with Overlord. I am Uncle Swinny. And we uh, And now we must save the elves from being tormented by a really, really bad play. Oh, sure, you may laugh, but a really bad movie or video oh. game is nothing to laugh about. Unless there's someone else making wise tracks over the movie. Attack every night, crushing the elves into the ground of their precious forest. <gasps> ah, goody, I can't even get. Let me pass. The root on eyes, top. My poor eyes! I can't take anymore! The root on top of the. Dead minions of whatever's rule, whatever this voice is. Red You choose all. Act one, in which the elven race live peacefully, deep in the Evernight Forest, protected by their unworthy deity, the Mother Goddess. I never said that. <laughs> the same play over and over again. Only at a young age is that ever harlot. considered fun. She alone will listen to our woe, our song, <laughs> and our poetry. <clears throat> Act two, in which the dwarves attack every night, crushing the elves into the ground of their precious forest. Oh, my eyes, my poor eyes, I can't take anymore. Let's destroy their seating. How can they call this art? <laughs> Okay, I clearly misunderstood what these things are for. Tether still broken. Back to Act One. Hey, you deal with the elves. This is quite monotonous. How can they call this art? Sleep peacefully deep in the Evernight Forest, protected okay, by their unworthy the deity, the fight Mother our way Goddess. Through the wraiths on the, on the right side of the arena. The problem is, I, I think they my friend, we are. Let us pray to the Mother Goddess. For although she is a cold and uncaring harlot, undeserving of worship. She alone will listen to our woe, our sorrow, and our poetry. Act two, in which the dwarves attack every night, crushing the elves into the ground of their precious forest. I can tell you're getting a feeling of catharsis from this. I never said that. 
Okay. How can I call this art? The Mother Goddess! Oh, brother, how lucky we elves are to live in the bounteous green bosom of Evernight. I, my friend, we are. Let us pray to the Mother Goddess. For, although she is a cold and uncaring harlot, undeserving of our worship, she alone will listen to our love, our sorrow, and our pain. Any I ask for the sake of bad comedy. and break everything except for the stuff I need that you don't break you choose all Just be going the wrong way. Ah, there's the light. 
fighting cue. Right, act one again. It's Roly. That must be the <laughs> terror. Oh, better find a way to reach it, my lord. Zap! Toro, 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 Toro. Ah, you chose all. Oh. Never mind. My fears were completely unfounded. That time, anyway. <laughs> Those rapes playing the dwarves get ready, sire. Ah, splendid work. Very moving. Couldn't get me an autograph. Act two, in which the no. dwarves attack ever night, crushing the elves into the ground of their precious forest. Nice. Okay, whoever this guy is, he is. Browns! He is getting a wicked catharsis high. Greens! <coughs> Blues! Browns! You choose all! Tell us, still oh. broken! Back to Act One! Live peacefully deep in the Evernight Forest, protected by the unworthy deputy, the Mother Goddess. I, my friend, we are. Let us pray to the Mother Goddess. For although she is a cold and uncaring harlot, undeserving of worship. She alone will listen to our woe, our sorrow, and our poetry. Act two, in which the dwarves attack Evernight Forest. Dwarves! Dwarves! <laughs> I think that's your cue, Master. Hello. Remember, dwarves, I want to feel hate. I want to feel anger. I want to smell the beer on your beards. Minions don't grow beards. The closest one I've ever seen was a goatee on the next goatee. Stop. Prepare for that. Without the terror, the play can't progress. No autograph, please. I must have my rest. Your working conditions, I don't blame you. You choose all. I can't perform under these conditions. I can't take the pressure. It's ruining my nerves. You must be right behind the stage, sire. It's where all the lovely, wonderful magic of the theater happens. Who figured you from theater, Nutnarl? 
Sleep chasing oh. deep in the Evernight Forest, protected by their unworthy deity. And now, the Mother Goddess, to screw up the performance. I know that voice, that condescending tone. <laughs> Don't worry, it'll come to me, sire. I, my friend, we are. Let us pray to the Mother Goddess. <laughs> Okay, this is probably going to backfire me horribly if it works in the first place. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Have I honestly expected that? You choose all. Stairs are a prop. What big sense does that deep make? In the Evernight Forest, protected by their unworthy deity, the Mother Goddess. Oh, this is much better. I, my friend, we are. Let us pray to the Mother Goddess. For although she is a cold and uncaring harlot, undeserving of our worship. She alone will listen to our woe, our sorrow, and our poetry. Act two, in which the dwarves attack Evernight, crushing the elves into the ground of their precious forest. I had to sneeze. <laughs> Stage pieces down. <laughs> 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 Are you working under the assumption if that it means that if you restart the play over and over master. again, you'll eventually get around? Terror will eventually be repaired. If it, that is what you're banking on, that is incredibly in which the not elven smart. race live peacefully, deep in the Evernight Forest, protected by the unworthy deity, the Mother Goddess. Although she is a cold and uncaring harlot, undeserving of worship, oh. she alone will listen to our woe, our sorrow, and our poetry. Act two, in which the dwarves attack Evernight, crushing the elves into the ground of their precious forest. <laughs> Killed your dwarves again. Yeah. 
Not apologizing for that one. Are you the understudies? Protected by their unworthy deity, Green. the Mother Goddess. Oh! I, my friend, we are. Let us pray to the Mother oh. Goddess. For although she is a cold and uncaring harlot, undeserving of worship, she alone will Green. listen to our one. The dwarves attack every night, crushing the elves into the ground of their precious forest. Oh! Protected by the unworthy deity, the Mother Goddess. I, my friend, we are. Let us pray to the Mother Goddess. You choose. For although she is a cold. Ah, you found the terror side. I think this Please. could be your starring role. If you can oh. find a way to fix them, you can now create the Mace of Doom, sire. I haven't seen an of doom weapon for years. Each power strike from this will send your enemies flying yes. through the air. Oh, you choose all. Some, something is amiss. Browns. Oh. <laughs> There's only six ever get on. Oh, 
Let's go back to the tower and see if we can try this again. Something is amiss here. Red, I green. don't like it. <laughs> oh. Seriously, what is going on here? What should be going on here? Lights down. Prepare for Act One, you useless creatures. Without the terror, the play can't progress to the third act. I hear it has a great ending, sire. Truly epic. There must be a way further backstage. Uh, well, if in doubt, push, smash, or kill until you get some answers, master. Act one. In which the elven race live peacefully deep in the Evernight forest. Protected by their unworthy deity, the Mother Goddess. Okay. I, my friend, we are. Let us pray to the Mother Goddess. For although she is a cold and uncaring harlot, undeserving of worship, she alone will listen to our woe, our sorrow, and our poetry. Act two. In which the dwarves attack Evernight, okay. crushing the elves into the ground What's of their over precious here? Why forest. Is it important, and will it get that infernal steamroller moving? Okay, I think I know the problem is really really prop is those big wooden beams on it that the minions push. attack Evernight, crushing the elves into the ground of their precious forest. Brown, Green, 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 Green,
Back to Act One. Oh. Flimsy backdrop. Surprising for production this amateurish. Audience awaiting Dark Master. <laughs> The terror comes to Evernight Forest. <laughs> and my timer is gone shit. out, but oh, who's madly creature? But who really cares at this point? Hey, you're stripped cold for terror of Evernight. Didn't exactly say no minions allowed. to my community theater days. Well, that explains everything. You choose all! Go forth and purge these terrible actors! Crush them! Crush those mother goddess worshippers! <laughs> Lord. 
I weren't these also with me. I know you've been spending who knows how long watching a terrible play about the downfall of your race, but come on! It's the modicum of dignity. How can I have my play? Without my play, how will I be remembered? I must be remembered. What a weirdo. So, you enjoyed the show, subcreature? I see you have an appreciation for the finer points of punishment. Your actions amuse me. I have plenty more abysses. Why don't you entertain me by trying to conquer those? <laughs> you and your little vermin army. <laughs> They're not vermin. You are master Maybe of the greens, abyss, but sire. That's more However, of a smell. If what he said is true, we have work to do. Uh, always work. Work, 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 work. But for now, we are done. This has been Uncle Sweeney with Overlord. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe, click the little bell notification icon, and I'll see you next time. Until then, goodbye.